ensuring a seamless payment gateway for your business either on your wordpress website or even for business without a website is one of the most important aspect for any business owner Flutterwave offer one of the easiest and safest payment gateway for both online and offline businesses. In this tutorial, I will show you how to install and activate Flutterwave payment gateway on your WordPress website so that people can pay for your product or service directly from your website from anywhere in the world. With Flutterwave payment gateway, you can receive money in more than 30 currencies from different places starting of course with receiving payments in naira or just any other currency if you're ready for this then let's get started okay i want to assume that you already have woocommerce set up on your e-commerce website because you wouldn't be looking for payment gateway for your website if you don't have a product or service to sell and woocommerce is the most popular e-commerce plugin to create your online store or wordpress so if you don't have WooCommerce set up already, go ahead and do that. But since this video is not about creating an e-commerce website, I won't be talking about WooCommerce deeper than this. Secondly, before you can integrate the Flutterwave payment method for your WordPress website, I will also assume that you already have a Flutterwave account. If you do, then go ahead and log in. But if for adventure you don't have a Flutterwave account already, then go ahead and watch the video currently displayed on your screen where I show you the simple steps to opening a Flutterwave account for yourself. It's a short video, so watch it, set up your Flutterwave account, and then continue here with us. So now that your e-commerce website is already configured and you have your Flutterwave account ready, let's go ahead and integrate our payment gateway so people can begin to shop and pay for any of your product or service on your website from anywhere in the world. So the first thing to do now is to log in to WordPress, come to the plugin option and click add new. Here at the search bar, type in WooCommerce Rave. Flutterwave Payment Gateway plugin is called Rave. Click install. Activate. Cool. Now, come here and look for your newly installed plugin. Here is mine, so I will come below this plugin and click settings. Make sure that you are in the payment tab. Okay, before we complete our setup, this is an optional notification. To avoid situations where bad network makes it impossible to verify transactions, set up your webhook URL here to the URL below. Okay, like I said, this is optional, but I think we should set this up. So just copy out this URL. Then let's quickly head over to our Flutterwave account and paste this link where it's requested us to paste it. So here is my Flutterwave account. Come to settings, web hooks. Okay, just highlight this default URL and paste the URL we copied from the Rave plugin on our WordPress dashboard. Nice. So let's get back to our Rave settings and complete our installation process. Click the enable Rave box. Leave all these default settings. Let's go down. Here, untick this test mode and this field will automatically change to live keys. You will need to supply these keys here and you will find them in your Flutterwave account. So let's quickly head over to our Flutterwave account again to generate our secret keys. Still here in the settings tab, click the API keys tab. So here, copy out the live public key here. Make sure you are in the live API keys tab up here. So do the same for the live secret key and paste it in here also. Come down here. I will enable the save card box here. It will allow your customer's details to be automatically saved. 
so shopping can be easier for them next time they come to your website to shop save changes If I come to the WooCommerce settings here, you will see that Rave has been successfully integrated into my WooCommerce and now you can decide to either use only the Rave payment option choice, especially if your target market is based in, say, Nigeria. If that is what I want, I will come in here and turn off these other payment options just so that shopping can be less confusing and easier for my customers. But again, you can decide to allow as many payment options as possible which will give shoppers different options for payment. This is especially beneficial if you are selling internationally and you have a wider market. So this is how to integrate the Rave by Flutterwave payment option to your website using the Rave plugin and the WooCommerce setup. Please, if you got value from this video, like it and if you want easy and straightforward marketing tips like this, then make sure you are subscribed to this channel and turn on the alert notification so you get to know when I release other important tips like this. Thank you.